YouTube, what is going on? Chris Paternos, Comics and Pop Culture. I got three packages to open with you all today. Super excited. If you guys aren't subscribed to the channel yet, though, please take some time to do so and check out all the awesome links below, including how you can become a patron member of the channel for only $3.99 a month and a YouTube Journals member for only $1.99 a month by clicking that join button below. But guys, it is A1 Wednesday, and it's a very special A1 Wednesday, and I'm going to tell you why before we get into these books. One, you guys know how I rep my local shop, A1 Comics, and I always talk about their live sales every Wednesday night on Instagram, but they also have their live sales on Friday as well. This Friday is a very, very special live sale because it's their one year anniversary, and boy, has it been a year for all of us, and I want to give a big, big kudos and shout out to A1 for uh, taking the trials and tribulations of this last year head on and really pushing through it and creating this presence on social media and on Instagram and really becoming a not only a, a pillar in my community in the Sacramento area but nationwide by allowing folks that live all over the states to be able to participate in all the goodness that is A1 Comics through their live sales. So Here's the schedule. As always, tonight, 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, it is going down. But you're going to want to tune in to Friday's uh, live sale as well. 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. So what I recommend you guys do is come check my Friday Night Live at 4 o'clock Pacific. And then when we're done, wrapped up, go head over to A1 Comics and check it out. It's going to be an awesome, awesome show. I'll be posting more details on my Instagram throughout the week. So... With that being said, oh, by the way, their information is below. If you want to uh, follow them on Instagram, check out their website or their YouTube below. All right, let's get into some packages. All right, first one up. Let's see. What should we do first? No, I'm going to save that one. Oh, you know what? I think it's only fitting that I, before I open these packages, I show off a book that I got a, about two weeks ago now from an A1 Comics Instagram live sale. So yeah, I support my shop any way I can as well, including on their live sales. So let me show you guys what I picked up from them. We got an Uncanny X-Men number 98. Early uh, appearance of the, uh, the new team. And it's a really nice, fine plus looking copy. And I was very happy to to win these. It, it's tough sometimes, man. You get, you know, you got to be uh, on your phone or your tablet or whatever. And, and you got to be ready to see what you want and, and go for it. Because they have some goodness. And uh, a lot of times, there's a lot of people looking at them. I was, I put in a, I tried to claim a couple others that night. But I wasn't as, as quick as I needed to be uh, on the draw. So other some other folks uh, won those. But I was able to win this. Very happy, um, all things X-Men right now, man. I'm, I'm telling you, uh, it's just a matter of time before we get some type of real announcement of what they're going to be doing with the X-Men in the MCU and who they're going to be bringing to the X-Men team. So, very happy to get this from A1 Comics. All right, let's go into the first box. Let's, let's do this one first. This one has been sitting, I'm telling you guys, I let these accumulate. I think this was either eBay or Macari. I don't remember. I, I I know what this other one is. And I've been, it was a pre-order, so give a little hint there. What is, oh, yes. Okay. Yes. I got this tape down. This was a Mercari buy. And I was looking at this seller in these books. For a long time, actually, for a very long time. Look at, oh yeah, I might get a. He, uh, the seller has more of these. You can tell it's it's large. Um, oh my gosh, it's just I love this. I love this. I want to get more. I want to get more. Okay, here it is, guys. Transformers magazine number eighty four. Look at that Galvatron. Look at that art, man. This is amazing. Unicron. Unicron in the back. Oh man, I don't have any of these. Or I didn't have any of these Transformers mags until now. Look at that art. That's just beautiful. 
Uh, it's got, you know, let me see. It's got some, uh, some wear. Let's see, look at that. Definitely has some wear, but not too much. It's a beautiful looking book. Full color on the inside. Look at this. That is just beautiful in my humble opinion. Look at that. Let's look at these inside pages. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's get to something. There we go. Look at this. Really cool. Really cool. So these are from um, the UK. As you can see, it's uh, 30 pence. They have... Um, and obviously, these are from the 80s. This is the 80, 86. Yep, October 86. And it has more the the magazine type paper. Oh, look, it's got a Galactus story in here, too. Sick. I didn't know about that. Look at that. Man. Transformers and Galactus under the same magazine. I'm not complaining. Going up against Hercules here. So I'm very, like I said, I'm very happy to have uh, purchased this and I might want to grab uh, one or two more from the seller because they had a few of them on the, on the Mercari app for sale. So very happy to pick this up. Awesome. Awesome stuff. All right. Next up. Yeah, let's go with this one. Let's go with this one. All right. So if I remember... This was, geez, a pre-sale from eBay. They really squished this Gemini mailer down. And just to let everyone know, I am planning my second uh, claim sale on Instagram shortly. I was going to do it this coming Sunday. I don't think that's going to happen, so I'm pushing for the next Sunday. But uh, I, I've gotten a lot of books ready. So really looking forward to that. All right, man. Let's see what we get. Oh, oh, man, they got... Tony, painter's tape, guys. Painter's tape. <laughs> painter's tape on the inside. All right, here we go. This is from Markdown Comics. Oh, my gosh. They just... They got the packaging tape all over everything. And it's good and secure, but I'm telling you, you try to open up, you try to rip open the um, packaging tape on the books like this, and you can bend the books. You gotta be really careful, and that's why I recommend packaging tape on the outside, nothing but painter's tape on the inside, all day, every day. All right. Oh, yeah, here we go. Look at that. Beauties. Beauties. Amazing Spider-Man 55, third printing. Look at that beautiful blue. So I will be giving one of these away in an upcoming contest, most likely a patron-only contest. Awesome. So now I got my first print. I got a few copies of the second print. I'm giving one of those away. And then I'll also be giving one of these away. So really happy to finally have these uh, in my hand. Blue looks good. I thought it was a bit of a, more of a teal blue from the from the pictures. But it's, it's a pretty solid, uh, kind of a standard blue. Like a Captain America blue. You know. <laughs> awesome. Awesome stuff. Very happy to finally have those. Okay. We got one more box to open up today. If I could find, you know, I always do this when I'm filming. I set my blade down and then I can't find it. Here it is. I'm all over the place, guys. I'm telling you. All right. This is a Midtown Comics order. That's why I saved it for last. And for those that know, I've talked about it over the last year and my issues with Midtown. This is most likely previews order that I ordered last February. And I don't mean last February, like two months ago. I mean, last February, like 2020. 
And of course, I still have not been reimbursed for uh, the $50 worth of books that were canceled and I never received. So this isn't a new order from Midtown. Just want everyone to know that. It's not. It's not a new purchase. Let's see what we got. Finally, finally, yes, oh my gosh, Transformers, Legends and Rumors, number one, the 100 page giant, Transformers 84, oh my gosh, I've been waiting over a year, so happy to finally get this, and another thing, this is, yeah, you know, another thing that I noticed about Midtown too is um i mean this one's not too bad but good luck getting a 9.8 from them to send into cgc i ordered uh four copies of spawn 311 the todd mcfarland tribute to um uh, chadwick boseman and they all came warped and they had basically spine stress and spine ticks running throughout i pressed and cleaned them and and, and dings like on the corners and whatnot so, uh, yeah, I, I wanted to send one in to, uh, to CGC, but I, I couldn't. I was sitting there pressing them for a week straight. I ordered a couple more from where I ordered them from. I think it was my comic shop, and one of those is, is going to go. So, uh, as you may know, everyone, I, I switched my monthly orders from my previews orders from Midtown to my comic shop last May, and I wish I would have done it sooner. I will never go back to Midtown. Never. Um, and I've said this before and I'll say it again. I really don't like, um, you know, talking bad about any business. I was a loyal Midtown um, customer for, for about 10 years. And unfortunately, their, their customer service just, or their lack thereof, I'm not going to, I'm not going to lie about it. You know, I just, I can't, I can't give them my business like that anymore. Um, and that's Midtown dot com not you know the the stores i don't know if the stores are ran differently but i haven't been to them so there it is everyone that is my pickups for this a one wednesday thank you all so much for watching let me know what you guys thought of my pickups what have you guys picked up over the last week or so and of course again a1 comics guys tonight 5 p.m pacific 8 p.m eastern don't miss it at a1 comics information is below and of course Friday, big Friday live sale on Instagram. They're also live on Twitch every Thursday. So thank you all for watching. Leave some comments below. Be well. And until next time.